Hello everyone, welcome to App Unbox. While looking for a design tool, you may hear about Kittle. If you don't know much about this design solution, then this video is just for you, because we are going to explore and describe the tool in this video. So let's get started. First we're going to get a web browser and then we are going to go to a Google search Kittle. Alright, so first one is the Kittle's website. So we're going into the website and now we're going to try Kittle for free. Alright, so we're going to use Google to sign up for a free account. Alright, now we're going to select our Google account. So there we have it, our Kittle has been registered. Uh, what are we using Kittle for? Well, let's see. Inspiration. Oh man, it's gone. Alright, so social media. Let's see what a Kittle editor has uh, in social tabs, as you can see. And it's app.club.com slash social. Alright, we can choose templates. We are going to skip tour. Okay, we're going to skip tour again. All right, we have new project here. As you can see guys, new project here. We can uh, change background color to anything that we want. All right, but first things first, we are going to go and explore the app uh, mainly. As you can see, we have all category here. Then we have Kittle AI. Then we have logos. We have labels. We have t-shirts, posters, cards, social y2k streetwear and everything so it depends on you what are you trying to make cards posters t-shirts social media posts streetwear and anything in between so what i'm going to do is i'm going to make a card at the moment so let's select this template cards all right so here are the perfect cards design that it's uh, given to me so now i can select any card template and then I can edit it to my own likings. So let's see what we can do. Mm, let's say we're going to make a Christmas card. All right. So here is a Christmas card. Let's select it. I'm going to use this design. So let's select use design. And then we are going to be redirected to Kittle editor. All right, guys. So as you can see, we have our holiday greetings, flat lake Christmas ornament card. So we can edit this card as we want. As you can see, we can uh, move all these things according to our likings. So let's see what, as you can see, we can press control Z to just uh, place it uh, where it was. And then we have these texts that we can edit. These texts are also available here. Christmas. As you can see, we have curved text here. Let's see how we can manage these curved texts. All right, so here it is, arc curve. So as you can see, these texts are being curved from these options here. And we can uh, curve these texts uh, more if we need. So that's how these texts have been curved. Now, rise curve. All right, these texts can be edited in many ways. and. Uh, we have circle here. I'm pretty sure that this month this one is the circle as you can see Yes, this one is the circle and we can see the custom transformation. Let's see what goes with custom transformation So we have custom transformation here and in custom transformation we can just drag these texts around like uh, We can drag them like snakes as you can see uh, so custom transformation is really cool if you can if you know what you're doing okay just like uh, I'm, I don't know what I'm doing so custom transformation is really shitty for me and if you know what you're doing then custom transformation can be a really good thing as you can see I've confirmed it and now again control Z because I've moved the whole frame so as you can see this custom transformation is ready and it looks really really curvy so uh, well let's edit it again and change something in between all right so let's see i'm gonna lower out these lines a little all right now that's uh, somewhat lookable so as you can see guys you can uh, edit your uh, edit your thumb so as you can see guys you can edit your uh, design and you can make whatever you want out of it you can just change these group colors to your likings as you can see i want to uh, let's say i want shan color in the blue as you can see, I have selected cyan color in blue, and then we what does this one change? This one changes these leaf colors. We can uh, select green leaf colors, although the leaves don't stay green in winter. However, we can choose any color that we like, and you can also choose any color to your liking and make a colorful greeting card here. 
I'm pretty sure this one is the background. Yes, the background cannot be changed. Let's go ahead and check our background. As you can see, this is the background and we have texture here. We have textured background and that's why the um, color on the front also looks uh, somehow. As you can see guys, I've decreased the opacity of the background and if I increase the opacity of the background, then the whole color will be blended with it. As you can see, the opacity is 100%. You can change the opacity to your liking. If zero, you get plain color. And if you get 50%, it looks good, but 100% is not quite good. So I'm gonna change it to 75%. And as you can see, now our car looks really aesthetic and beautiful. So you can select all of these things, adjust and make any template to your liking. And you can also change your project name. I'm gonna give this one my card. And then you can download it to your computer. Uh, these are the pro features. You can remove background, optimize quality, remove Kittle logo. This one, they're talking about this one. If you want to remove this logo, you will have to purchase their uh, premium membership. So, well, we don't, we're not gonna purchase premium membership now. So you can, uh, you can download it in JPG format or PNG format. Uh, well, PNG is much more convenient. So I'm just gonna select PNG. Well, what's it, select an iller? Remember Kindle, credit Kindle, all right. No worries, as you can see, my card has been downloaded and we can view it from my computer. As you can see, their Kittle logo is here and if you don't want this logo to be here, you'll have to purchase their premium membership in order to remove that logo. All right, so we're done with cards now. Let's go ahead and go to social media or something. All right, so we're gonna go to Kittle homepage again. You can select a project and you can start making something from scrap by going to new project. As you can see, we have a new file here and we can start from scrap and depending on our page size, standard, poster small, A5, A4, postcard, all of these, Facebook post, Instagram post, poster big. So we're gonna select something, let's say Facebook post size and we can select create. All right, so we have a new project here. We can change our background color here. And as you can see, we have all the color palettes that's needed. You don't have to select colors customly. You can just select it from the presets that are here. All right, these are the premium colors, so we can't select premium colors because we're not premium membership. And we can add textures for our background from here. As you can see, I'm gonna select this texture. And you can select the opacity for the texture. And you can select how would you like the texture to act like overlay or just something else. All right, so normal color burn overlay. Okay, that's normal and that's overlay and that's multiply. The multiply looks actually the most beautiful. So I'm just gonna keep multiply and decrease this one to 80% because it looks good. But you can select all of these textures and there are lots of beautiful textures to choose from. And you can add your photos to your project by adding here. You can add any texts, you can add elements. As you can see, there are lots of elements here but uh, they're premium, so we won't be able to add them at the moment. Illustrations, well, we have free illustrations. So let's go ahead and drag one. All right, so I'm gonna keep it like this. And you can select illustrations for your post. We have color modification here. Modify color to your liking. And then you can add text if you need. As you can see, we can uh, modify any of these texts that we need. All right, so we have selected a vintage text and now we're gonna edit this text. We have it and now we're gonna double click on this, then double click on this. And now we can write something that we want. As you can see, we're gonna write test project. All right, now we're gonna click outside and it will just be blended in its place. Finest not blend, I'm gonna change it. Well, it's not fitting in, so let's say we have to decrease our text size and then we have to decrease our text length as you can see we can drag it and now it has fitted in place now we're gonna change this one then we can change these if necessary you can change this one you can change this one as you can see guys lots of things can be done here and uh, you can make an entire project out of scrap so that's done i'm gonna save this one at test and then i'm gonna download the png file here Voila, downloaded successfully. Well, why is, hasn't it been saved? So we're gonna press Control S and save it. 
saved just now and then we have closed the window so as you can see guys you can do a lot more with candle you can select from their preset custom designs and templates or you can create an entire file out of scraps and you can make an entire project out of scrap using kindle's tools their effects their texts and their backgrounds are also really nice so guys if you found this tutorial helpful please leave a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching our video until we meet again next time stay safe and goodbye